review is going to be on this infrared uh, thermometer that has a nice range of negative 58 degrees Fahrenheit to 626 degrees Fahrenheit. So it actually comes with the AAA batteries already, which is housed right inside here. And then you just snap that back into place, and in order to turn it on, you just hit the trigger like that, and then it will show um, your different settings here. Your, you have to click the red button if you want to be in Celsius, or you click on it again to be in Fahrenheit. So, um, and then whenever you want to measure the surface temperature, you just click on the trigger and it, and it um, shoots out this little red beam, this little laser that's going to read the temperature. So, I'll just try out this surface real quick over here. And so, it's reading about a temperature of about 76 degrees Fahrenheit. And then we'll just go to my freezer real quick. Oops. And we'll just try it out what it's like in the freezer. We'll aim it at some ice. So let's aim it at some ice and see what happens. And as you can see here, this is the beam aimed at some ice. And it's showing the ice is negative 14 degrees, whoops, give it some time to cool down I guess, let's let it wait until it finds a good stopping point but my hand keeps on shaking so that doesn't help at all, but anyways it's going anywhere from negative 12 to negative 15 degrees Fahrenheit, so that's what that looks like, pretty neat, but you can use this for different applications, um, I actually use this laser gun to paint my, my caliper decals, instead of putting my caliper into an oven, I decided to bake them with a heat gun, and I had to use this thing to aim it at the uh, caliper itself to make sure that I'm at the right temperature. If you click on the link in the description below, you'll be able to, be able to find out exactly where I get these from for dirt cheap. Hope you like my quick little review. If you have any questions, be sure to comment below, but as always, thank you all for watching.